Hi everybody, Chris back with you talking college football with the University of Maryland. The Terps have now dropped three games in a row after falling on the road to Northwestern last weekend. They now welcome in 7-1 Penn State to College Park this weekend. Head coach Mike Loxley and his team talked about the matchup with the Nittany Lions. Losing back-to-back -back games by one score uh, is disappointing. Um, we're a team that, you know, we talked about being ready to compete for championships, but obviously uh, we're, we're just not there yet. Um, but that won't stop us from continuing to do the necessary work to get us to that point. These past two games, we had two two minute drives and um, we just, as an offense, we just didn't come through. And um, it's, you know, it's um, a collective thing and it really starts from the quarterback. So just me staying with my process and continue to prepare hard and just continue to, to uh, work hard with each other and uh, try to figure it out. So. We got Penn State coming into the shell this week, uh, a team that has all of our attention. Um, they're a top 10 team, uh, one of the more talented teams in the country. Uh, you know, I look at this week as a great opportunity for us here at home. Obviously, their, 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 their defense is one of those uh, top tier defenses. They play a lot of man coverage, which we have to be able to defeat man coverage this week. Their front seven is one of the best ones we faced or will face uh, this year. I feel like their defense is really special just because they're they're really athletic and they uh, they get off the ball pretty quick. Um, you know, if you look at their their scheme, they they run a lot of blitzes as well. So um, we know that we have our work cut out for us in that aspect. I feel like um, it'll just be putting a body on a body this week and just you know uh, living up to the standard that we try to set for ourselves. And I feel like if we can do that, it'll be a four quarter fight. You look at them on offense, it starts with the run game, which a year ago, I think they rushed for over 250 yards. So I would imagine that they're going to try to establish the run. Um, our goal will be to, to take the run away on the defensive side of the ball. And how do you do it? You know, if you look at the way we've played Penn State, when we've been able to have success, it's been being very aggressive um, in terms of lining guys up, attacking a line of scrimmage, uh, and, and forcing them to throw the ball to beat us. And that's what we'll, we'll try to do this, this upcoming week. The receiving room is pretty solid, you know, him and then you have uh, Cephas, who's also experienced with playing before when he was at Kent State. So, I mean, they're both, you know, good good receivers. They can catch the ball. They're smooth. They know the route tree. So, I mean, you know, it'll be, it'll be a ball game for us. But, you know, as our DB room, we, we love a good competition. Maryland and Penn State kick off at 3.30 from Maryland Stadium in College Park this Saturday afternoon.